Hello, I'm Amanda. And I'm Joshua. And we're from all seven of us. And today we're going to be showing you a chip cutter. I love this chip cutter. Saves so much time. We've had this one for years. And as you're going to see in the video, it's gone through the dishwasher a few times and it is not dishwasher safe. So <laughs> It needs replacing. <laughs> so please watch the full video. Please like and subscribe and we'll get right into it. Good afternoon. Today I am going to show you our latest chip cutter. Uh, my family loves chips. We cannot always buy frozen chips, um, but most of the time we have potatoes at home, so that makes it a lot easier. We purchased this one off eBay. Uh, it's very, very easy to use. And not only does it have the chip cutting section, it also has a grater, um, slicing tomatoes, and then you've got other slicing there. And then this one. We also have a lid, so when you finish with your slicing, you can put the lid on, put it in the fridge. Okay, so um, the thing is, it is not dishwasher safe. Um, the box is just plain white, so I'm not sure if it said that on the box, but my children have put it in the dishwasher a few times, and so now it's all um, melted from the hot water. So the lid doesn't quite fit on square anymore, but I still love it. Um, yeah, so on the inside, that's your chips. You've got your big ones or your skinny ones. I find it hard to cut the skinny ones. Um, so these are ones that I prepared earlier. And Josh is going, great, because I'm hungry. So the potatoes, the, the chips are easy. I just always just push the potato down a little bit and then just push, 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 push. Then I can tell that I, yeah, made the potato fall over. So just... Daniel reckons I love making chips when I'm angry because then I just get to bash it. Okay, as simple as that. And now there are chips, nice and long. And I'm going to go fry these up for Joshua's lunch. 